the sun don't shine like this I'm the shit Real life, man. We in here with that boy, Lil Will, man. Going down North Dallas, Texas. <laughs> real oh, shit, man. real shit. Man, tell us what you got, what you think about this rap scene right now, man. Shit, I feel like, I feel like the rap scene right now, man, it's turning around. You know what I'm saying? I mean, a lot of niggas starting to realize that unity is the key, man, and that's the only way we're gonna make it. You know what I'm saying? So. I feel like this shit good. I mean, as far as this new Dallas shit, I mean, I feel like, you know, niggas got their good intentions, but what's so new about it? You know what I'm saying? There's nothing newer than what old Dallas was trying to do. You know what I'm saying? So I, I feel like it's a it's a difference, you know what I'm saying? But it ain't a difference. You know what I'm saying? Because at the same time, I mean, when I was rocking, it wasn't no animosity to the DSRs and uh, the the motherfucking ricochets and the, the Rose and even Lil Shine, you know what I'm saying? All the motherfucker that was popping around that time, the GS boys, the motherfucking, you know what I'm saying? And everybody else, it, it wasn't no, it wasn't no hard feelings, man. So I feel, I feel like, shit, it always, it always been a unity, it's just niggas didn't acknowledge it until now, so. I mean, I respect the New Dallas shit, man. I respect niggas' movement. I respect what they trying to do. It is, but I feel like it's it's really it shouldn't it shouldn't be no New Dallas movement. It should be Dallas, nigga. It should be D-Town, stay down. You know what I'm saying? The nigga shouldn't have to give it a new title to make it feel like something, nigga. We all come to an agreement and all come on a unity. We shouldn't give it a new title. We should just take it for what it is. You know what I'm saying? Since since it's a new Atlanta, niggas want to put a new Dallas. Nah, bro, we still Dallas, nigga. We D town, stay down. We triple D, however nigga want to call it. We still that man. We just wisened up, and we see that unity is what it is. You know what I'm saying? And now we coming together to make this shit work for everybody, where everybody see checks. That's how I feel about the shit. Real talk, real talk. That's real life about that unity, man. You know what I'm saying? What you feel about um? I don't know, like, uh, your, your songs, like, what's the new, what you working on right now, bro? Like, tell us something about that. Man, I'm working on a lot of shit, man. That nigga just came at me about a couple parts in the movies. I got two movies I'm finna be in, man. Uh, I'm steady working on these mixtapes, man. Uh, I'm back with the home team, man. For a lot of niggas that don't know, man, I'm back Rude Boy and T, you know what I'm saying? So, I got a real nigga. Free, free my real niggas, you know what I'm saying? Mixtape finna drop, you know what I'm saying? So, I, I'm just back at it, 110, man. If a lot of niggas, a lot of niggas didn't know where Lil Will been, man. Lil Will been on that road, man, getting to that money, man. So, I mean, shit, I'm back in the city now. I'm back in the studio, 110. So, I, I'm just working, man, doing a lot of motherfucking work. And I got three, four mixtapes going right now that's in process. I got a couple movies that's in process. I got a documentary I'm finna drop. Right. So it's just it's just shit I'm still working. You know what I'm saying? Even through even through all the motherfucking other bullshit that I'm going on, man, because if a lot of niggas that know me know I got law situation, you know what I'm saying? I'm going through this shit with DPD right now. They got me on probation and shit. And um uh, just shit, really I'm just touching back home, you know what I'm saying? They had me down four months, but Shit, uh, I mean, all this shit behind me, man. I'm back on these streets, I'm back on solid ground, and I'm back at it 110, you know what I'm saying? How you feel about Dallas DJs right now? I feel like Dallas DJs are... I, I feel like a lot of Dallas DJs ain't stand up. I mean, we do have our stand up DJs around here, you know what I'm saying? And that's like, shit, you know, like, DJs like Tuss, DJs like Q, DJs like Mel and Mac, you know what I'm saying, motherfucking, even G-Rock, you know what I'm saying, I'm always gonna give my respects to G-Rock, you know what I'm saying, so, it's always, it's always those certain DJs, like even DJ Wire, you know what I'm saying, like real nigga, so, I'm always gonna shoot my respects and my paybacks to those niggas, you know what I'm saying, but, 
at the end of the day, I feel like a lot of the rest of these DJs are prima donnas. And most of them ain't need from here. Like the PDs and shit in Dallas are not from Dallas. So they can give a fuck about Dallas. About Dallas artists, Dallas music, anything. Nigga, if your shit ain't motherfucking being sent from these labels and being, you know what I'm saying, certified from these ARs and these label heads, then they can give a fuck about it. They don't care about us, nigga. They trying to keep their job. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, as far as the DJs, I mean, I really, I really can't, I, I really ain't got too much to say about them, man, because at the end of the day, they trying to keep their job. They trying to keep their dance flow full. You know what I'm saying? And I, I be seeing a lot of little interviews where artists be like, man, fuck them whole ass DJ. They ain't trying to spend a nigga shit. Do, 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 do. Well, nigga, if that was the case, nigga, we wouldn't have niggas around this bitch like T-Cash. We wouldn't have a Doski G. We wouldn't have Fat Pimp that's still moving units in the club. You know what I'm saying? There's niggas that's still doing club music and still moving units in the club. We wouldn't have Trill Lee and Prince Rick. You know what I'm saying? Just being honest. Yeah. Just being honest, nigga. If a lot of us, if a lot of us artists really stepped our game up and stepped up to the plate, then the bitches wouldn't have no other choice to play us, nigga, because the streets dictate what them motherfuckers play. They can only play what the streets want. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, if they, if our shit bump and hurt, and they play uh, an Atlanta track, and everybody lead a dance flow, they gotta go right back to that Dallas track to get every motherfucking body feeling. It. You know what I'm saying? And that's just real shit. So we can't really fault the DJs, man. Them niggas just, they doing their job at the end of the day. But at the same time, I know it might sound contradicting, but at the same time, a lot of the DJs are prima donnas. And that's just what it is. Prima shit, real shit. Well, yeah, man. So shit's about unity, man. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like, you know, a reason that, you know what I'm saying, you know, my personal opinion, why, why this shit is separated, because artists don't, collab with other artists, you know what I'm saying? And because we so divided. It's like what does it take for an artist to collab with Lil Will? I mean, shit for an artist to collab with me, man, I mean for for one, you gotta have something, man. I ain't finna get in the booth with no side ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be you gotta have something for one, you know what I'm saying? I mean be talented at this shit. And you gotta be serious about this shit, man. I I mean I ain't finna play play, so we ain't finna go in that bitch and do no bullshit and be like, ah, bro, yeah, that, nah, it don't work like that. You know what I'm saying? This shit, it gotta be right and the shit gotta be on point, man, for a nigga to collab with me. And I feel like as if the reason a lot of artists and shit ain't linking up and doing shit because a nigga still stuck on this hood shit. Nigga so focused on Dallas and being a nigga in Dallas or being the best nigga in West Dallas, being the nigga best nigga in East Dallas, Pleasant Grove, Oak Cliff, North Dallas. Niggas so stuck on that shit that they ain't seeing the bigger picture. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, it's way more money outside of this shit, nigga. And once a nigga step out of town and step to other states and situations and see that shit, that's when a nigga will realize and they come back home like, man, we've been tripping. We need to get together and do this shit and do this shit for real. You know what I'm saying? Cause them niggas in Atlanta, they don't give a fuck, nigga. You know what I'm saying? They don't give a fuck if you from East, West, South, North, nigga, McKinneville, uh, Decatur. They don't give a damn, nigga. If they finna see a check out of it, nigga, they finna do it. You know what I'm saying? Shit. And they gonna get that money, nigga. And that's what we gotta realize at the end of the day, man. It's all about a profit, bro. We ain't, nigga ain't looking for fame, nigga. Fuck fame, nigga. Nigga, we trying to feed families. We trying to get out these streets. We got motherfucking niggas. We trying to put money on they books and all types of other shit that's going on. You know what I'm saying? So a nigga trying to stay down for this shit, man, and get what we deserve out this shit, nigga. And that's that guala. Yeah, shit, real shit. Is there anything you want to add to it, bro? Before we cut this interview, man, tell us something. Give a, give a nigga some, some street game, some industry game, whatever, man. Man, all I got to say is, man, stay consistent, persistent, and just stay down, man. You know what I'm saying? That's all I can tell a nigga, man, because other than that, it, it's nothing. You know what I'm saying? And fuck what another nigga got to say. Point blank, period, man. If you stay on you, your time will come, man. Real shit. And as far as all you hating ass niggas that I always got something to say about the next nigga, nigga, evaluate your motherfucking self first, nigga. When you decide to speak on another nigga, nigga, speak on yourself first. 
and then, you know what I'm saying, and then evaluate your situation, nigga. Because I've been seeing a lot of you niggas interviews talking about whoop the whoop, this, that, and the other, nigga. Nigga, evaluate your motherfucking self first, nigga. Then motherfucking say something, nigga. And yeah, I'm finna say this shit on real life TV because I'm a real life nigga, nigga. Nigga, I seen the motherfucking interview from, uh, 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 what's the name? Quint Fox, nigga. Yeah, I seen your interview, nigga. And I seen you had some shit to say to the road, nigga. And you also mentioned Doug in that motherfucker. But you know one motherfucking thing, nigga, Lil Will is a real motherfucking nigga, nigga. So I, like I told you, niggas, on my Say Cheese interview, nigga, the next nigga mentioned Lil Will or my Dougie or anything relating to that shit and that motherfucking shit, nigga. We coming at you, nigga. And is that how you want to take it, nigga? If you want to take it rapping, if you want to take it street, nigga, it's however, nigga. You know that, nigga. 8201 on that, nigga. You know my motherfucking hood, nigga. Exactly, nigga. I'll be in Kings and nigga been here. Ain't going no motherfucking word, nigga. Yeah, I got a house in the birds, but I'm out here in the north every motherfucking day, nigga. Come check my motherfucking status, boy. Real motherfucking shit, and it's just like that. And nigga, I don't give shout outs, nigga. I'm, nigga, I stated your name, nigga, because I really fucked with you, nigga. But you got me fucked up, nigga, confusing. Nigga, don't mix me in that bullshit, nigga. If you're shooting slugs at the row of the rest of them niggas, nigga, you know what it is, nigga. But one thing you do know, the wheel is a real nigga. Nigga, don't make me fuck over one of you niggas. And that's real motherfucking talk, nigga. That's real life for you niggas. Yeah, man, if everybody looking at me, man, y'all can go check me out, man. LilWill.com. Shit, you can Twitter me. Slash Lil Will, man. My uh, MySpace is still Lil Will. Facebook is still Lil Will, goddammit. And if you want Instagram, it's Lil Will8201. You know what I'm saying? Just like that, man. Oh, uh, matter of fact, just Google me. L I L W I L, and that'll link you to everything, man. Just like that, nigga. Real nigga, nigga. Still out here in these streets, nigga. Million dollar nigga. Still rocking it, nigga. In and out, nigga. Every motherfucking day. House in the birds, but I'm in the hood, nigga. Just like that. Uh, no limit to the way I'm